Welcome to Unit 11.6, Weight and Capacity. Let's start here. How many ounces does one cup weigh? It weighs 8 ounces. Most measuring cups show a scale for cups and a scale for ounces. In many parts of the world, cooks use the weight of ingredients rather than the capacity of a measuring tool in their recipes. One reasonable rule of thumb is the expression, a pint's a pound the world around. One cup equals eight ounces. How many ounces are in a pound? If you answered 16 ounces, you are correct. Here is some important vocabulary for today. Capacity, the amount of space occupied by a three-dimensional figure. This is also known as volume. Weight, how heavy something is. Now, let's listen to a story about the Gallon Kingdom. Once upon a time long, long ago, there was a kingdom called the Kingdom of Gallon. In the Kingdom of Gallon, there lived four queens. They were sisters and all looked exactly alike. I hate to tell you this, but soon the four queens got into a huge fight and couldn't agree on how to rule over the kingdom of Gallon. Finally, they decided to split the kingdom in half. Two queens ruled a half gallon in the north, and the other two queens ruled the half gallon kingdom in the south. Now that there was peace in the kingdoms, the queens got married, and each one had a prince and a princess. There is something I forgot to tell you. Each prince and each princess had two cats. One was black and one was white. And they all lived happily ever after. Pause the video to review these two charts. On the left side we have a chart of the metric system that covers units of length, units of area, units of volume, units of capacity, and units of weight. On the right, we have the U.S. customary system, which is what we use. It also covers units of length, units of area, units of volume, units of capacity, and units of weight. You will be using these charts extensively on your math work tomorrow. Here is your practice problem for the day. The dimensions of the rectangular prism on your homework sheet are length equals 15 inches, width equals 5 inches, and height equals 6 inches. Please read the directions on your homework sheet and find the answer on the back of your paper. Make sure to label the figure on your sheet and write your answer on the front side using the correct units and exponents.